Well, just um, just for anybody who doesn't know me, uh, my name's Gary. I'm Alison's brother. And it's a, it's a very proud moment for me to be standing up here. Alison after asking me to make a quick speech on her behalf yeah, yeah, to, uh, to formally to formally welcome Nigel into the. What's that, Sam? <laughs> Come here. Just cut down who you are. <laughs> I can't, I'll just take a sit down, I can't be that really, you know. But, uh, just where, I forgot where I was now. It was just, uh, yeah, it's a very proud moment for me to be asked by Alison to just to make a quick speech, and I don't want to bore you to tears, just to welcome, formally welcome Nigel into our family. And uh, just to take a round of applause for that. But as far as, far as, as, far as we're all concerned, you know, uh, he's been part of the family from the day one, so uh, not really changed to be honest with you, know. <laughs> but uh, I'd just like to say that's it really, and uh, just uh, raise your glasses and in a toast to the happy couple, and wish them many years of happiness in the future, to uh, Alison, Nigel and Sam, and, uh, there's, there's my drink, Alison, Nigel and Sam, uh, that's it, thanks very much, enjoy the night. Come on, Mango. Cheers. <laughs> I just want to say, I wrote out a speech but didn't even fucking look at it. It took me days to do it. I have a Do you want to do it? Thanks. Well played, buddy. Thank you all for the way you I hope you all enjoyed your meal. Enjoy the time. No part. Continue to enjoy life. Hey! Thank you so much and all that. It's very well with the weather. And I'd like to begin by thanking Nigel for asking me to be his best man. And We've been best friends for years, and it's, like, it's quite an honour, and uh, it's a thrill as well to do, like, to, to do the job. Um, over the last few years, I've seen Nigel kind of mature like, like a lot, I think, anyway. Beginning a, a career as a welder, becoming a father, and now uh, becoming a husband to Alison. And I think uh, meeting Alison has really been the making of him. Alison first noticed, noticed Nigel down the top house about five years ago. He was dressed as Yasser Arafat. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't Halloween, it's just Nigel. <laughs> it's Nigel. You know? That's a, it's a Nigel thing, we don't understand. That's the truth. So after noticing, a week or two later, they actually began talking. That first conversation was an argument about a shirt. Next time they met, it was an argument about Alison's blouse. I think that rounds up with being told she shouldn't rob her, her grandmother's wardrobe. <laughs> <laughs> and this kind of pattern went on for weeks and then months, and then I guess finally they ran out of things to argue about and just fell in love. The first time I met Alison was um, when I came back to visit for uh, uh, Sam's christening. And what really struck me first was like, um, how well they, they both adapted to being parents, but then also how well Alison complimented Nigel, how well they both complimented each other. Um, it's hard to read when you shake. That's my mother, Brandy. So I think that the last few years have seen they both made a lot of progress in a lot of ways. Um, when he first met Alison was an export manager working in a shipping company with Hazelair who helped with a lot of the organisation today. Um, she then began driving instructing and is now has her own uh, fledging driver driving skill which we hope will, which we know will be, be a big success. 
Of course, Elijah here, one of the chief of the Gerber there is now an expert welder. He's got a long, long successful career ahead of him. Um, so, I'm not married myself, and I thought like, I might be, get a sense like Michael's out there raising the bar for all of us here. So I thought I should ask him a bit of advice. It's only like um, <laughs> <you kiss. laughs> that. Who's that? You tell me that it's important to have a woman who helps at home, cooks, cleans, and helps <laughs> 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 Tommy, it's important to have a woman that can make you laugh. And also a woman who you can trust and doesn't lie. A woman who's fun in the bedroom, fun in the bedroom and also likes being with you. But most of all, it's very important these women never meet. <laughs> so, so when I'm trying to, when I was trying to like put a little speech together, I'm trying to like find words, my thoughts, and that it's kind of you get to the realization that there really, excuse me, there really isn't that many words, and what can they do? So, nothing really compares to. That's ultimately like nothing compares to the kind of the love and the feelings we have for you know this lovely couple here. So that knows I think I'll ask you to raise your glasses again. Wish them up prosperity and all the happiness in the world. Nice and awesome. say I'm delighted you're all here. It's just been great. We're so pleased to see all our friends and family here. It's fantastic. And I'd just like to say to Bob, brilliant speech. Fantastic. Yeah. Gary, perfect. Thanks Short and sweet to the point. I hope you didn't lose much money on the pool over how long it was going to take. <laughs> it's quite short. <laughs> and I just like to say all the ladies are <laughs> fabulous today. <laughs> all the ladies are fabulous and all the men scrubbed up really them. well. <laughs> How do you do it? How do you wish till I get there? All the men look fabulous, except especially Mr. Quigley. Bill. 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 I'd like to, Bill. Went to <laughs> I'd like to say a special thank you to May Rice, who's responsible for our beautiful weather today. It's a little favour yeah. from yesterday. So we've worked to thank for the lovely photos. So thank you, May. That's very much appreciated. Um, I'd like to say that I'm very happy to join the O'Shea's. A fantastic family. Very, been very welcoming over the years to me. Really, really kind and generous people. Woohoo! Yeah. Especially as well to Nigel's friends who have all been really, really welcoming to me. Very, very nice. Very, you know, they've just taken me in. There's no hassle, no grievances, and they're fantastic. So, lads, thank you very much to you all. <laughs> but, um, I'd just like to end and say thanks very much for coming. I'm delighted you're all here. You make the day very, very special for us. We've really enjoyed it. So, once the children go, then jackets off, shoes off, bit of dance, a bit of singing. Have you? Yeah, Woo! <laughs> and, um. <laughs> Thank you. 